Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Yesterday, American media reported that Islamic State sympathizers were planning an attack on the American Embassy in Ottawa and on a shopping mall. What's more, the Commissioner of the RCMP confirmed that they have active investigations ongoing of nearly 100 individuals who have traveled overseas to engage in terrorism. Canadians are concerned about these threats posed by radical Islamic extremists. Can the Minister of Public Safety today please update this House on this real terrorist threat to Canada? The Honourable Minister of Public Safety. Mr. Speaker, I want to thank the Chair of the Public Safety and National Security Committee for this important question. It's a great work on this issue. Our national security agencies are constantly reviewing the threat to our country and taking action to keep Canadians safe. Bien que je ne puisse commenter des questions liées à la sécurité nationale, il est clair que la menace islamiste et terroriste représente une menace sérieuse et que nous devons demeurer vigilants. That's the reason why I count on the support of all parties when our conservative government will bring action to provide tools so that law enforcement and national security agency can keep our country here, safe. Here.